Today I'm doing um, a one brush makeup challenge. Um, basically it's me randomly choosing a makeup brush from my bag of brushes and then just doing my entire face of makeup with just that one brush. Um, I did hear about, I, I say hear because I didn't actually watch a video but I did hear that there were youtubers who have done it so I don't know if I'm doing exactly the, the way they're doing it or whatever but yeah so I'm just going to choose with my eyes closed a random brush from here and we're just gonna get into it and we're gonna start my entire face of makeup with just that one brush <laughs> you know I found facial wipes that work absolutely phenomenally um, it is these this is what it is it's made in South Africa as you can see over there quickly produced I love local products I love supporting anything local um, and it's made with robots and I love this like it's a really 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 good product it gets my makeup off like this like that um, and it doesn't burn my skin or create my dry skin afterwards or yes so this is great you should try it and it's not that expensive okay so you guys know my routine always cleaning my face before I touch up touch on my makeup I'm gonna do my usual routine that I do before I apply my makeup and then I'll get back to you hi people I'm back <laughs> Okay, so now what I've done is laid out the brushes side by side. I've numbered each brush and put it in this box. I'm not sure if you can see. Um, and now we're going to choose a number. Okay, let's choose. This one. Wish me luck. Number five. Number five. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Guys, I chose a foundation brush. Okay, so putting foundation on with this brush is going to be a breeze. But I'm not sure how I'm going to do my eyes. <sighs> okay, well this is the brush I chose. This is the brush I gotta use. I'm gonna give this a little bit of a cleaning. Your brushes should be clean. And mine aren't. So wow, the... Ooh, ooh, I scratched it and now it's going through me. me. <laughs> okay, I don't know if they, they use the brush and then clean it. Because I haven't... I sh suppose I should have watched the videos, right? Okay, so I'm going to just do that because... I mean, I can't see how one can put eyeshadow on and then put foundation on and use the same dirty brush. Right? Okay, this brush is fairly clean. For eyebrows, I use the Woolworths Eye Duo. It comes with a, a comb on the one side, and then on the other side, it comes with a liner, quite a thick liner. By the way, I don't do eyebrows. I suck at eyebrows. Because I have such thick eyebrows, I don't really like do too much to it um, but I have started to notice that they sort of fade away when you put foundation on obviously um, and obviously we don't want that now do we just going to give it a little cleaning now I'm going to use my brush that I've chosen and just pat it down I just got like into the brow I don't know if you can see that did a fairly good job considering 
the size of this freaking brush. I'm going to apply my primer. I'm going to prime my eyes and just prepare it for the eyeshadow. Where'd my brush go? Okay, so I got this beautiful palette for my birthday. I have not used it yet. Um, as you can see, the the tape is still on it over there and over there it's the bur called the burgundy bar by maybelline it's a shimmer palette and i'm going to use it on my face now which kind of seems like a, a bit of a there's a sound in here why is there a sound in here sign on it. Does this palette come with Wi-Fi? I don't know. Oh, a duh. But it comes with a makeup brush. Which is what the, the shaking sound was. Yeah, it's gone. Oh, sometimes I can just really be questionable. And I'm going to go in the brush. Stop falling at me. Guys, my back hurts. I'm getting old. <laughs> my back really hurts. <laughs> okay, so I guess let's. You know, I suppose this is a good like trial for like if you go away and you forget to take any brushes or you just have one brush. I mean, it's good for that, I suppose. And I'm just gonna work it up. So, I think this brush is good for patting because of the flat surface. So, it's actually quite nice that I'm using the shimmer shades because you usually, with shimmer shades, you pat them on. Now I'm going to go in with the lighter shade over there. Oh, I've got some, oh, I've got some maroon on there. Burgundy. I'm sorry, I forget people don't say maroon anymore. <laughs> like, why? Why Why did maroon go from maroon to burgundy? Some of y'all have been drinking way too much Woolworths water. Guys, this is probably one of the hardest things I've ever had to do. Even harder than my normal makeup challenge. Okay. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with the darker sort of burgundy maroon color. Um the redder looking one. Which is that one. Um, that one. It's gonna be dark. I'm just gonna sort of place it on my eyelid. Keep it. And just try not to go above. To go above. To go above. To go above my crease. Leave it. <laughs> this is really, guys, makeup brushes really make a difference with the look because this brush is just literally not applying like very nicely. It's not even like as radiant as it is on my arm. It looks nothing like that on my eye. Besides for the fact that I'm using a terrible brush to apply the product. I'm really enjoying 
loving this palette. Like, I love the colors. Look at that. Look at that. Damn it. I'm having flashbacks. For me, it looks like such a clown. That just went right up there. I'm gonna try blending it. Mm. No. Look, I'm not to clean my eyes, right? I mean, this is not a don't clean your eye challenge because I can't actually look at myself any longer. Okay, so I'm gonna go in with um, that brown over there. Sort of gonna lay it on my outer eye and stay in the crease this is probably going to be a total disaster so just sort of dust it into the eye there I tried before the brown and just dust it under my eye to just give it that smoky finish now I look like I have rabies I mean there's not much I can really do right now so now I'm going to go in with this Iron Fushimi palette um, and I'm going to just use the white ladies if you ever admire have like big boobs and you've always admired someone with big boobs I'm here to tell you that you should be grateful for your little boobs because big boobs are a problem man my back hurts oh, my back hurts I can't stand for long really upsetting. I'm gonna start a GoFundMe for me to get a boob reduction because I can't I can't live like this. So I just did that. Awesome. Awesome stuff man. So that just happened. Okay I'm going to move on now because I'm clearly I'm moving on. Okay, I'm moving on. Cleaning off this brush again. I'm not looking at it anymore. I'm not even going to pay any attention to it. <laughs> whoosh, whoosh. Okay, now I'm going to do foundation. Um, I use the 130. Um, it sort of matches my face, but not really. Um, in summer, I can't wear it. Um, but in winter, I definitely can. I'm going to do concealer. This is going to be interesting. This is going to be so interesting. I wouldn't go out like this or go anywhere like this, really. But for the brush that I'm using, Okay, so now we're gonna do some eyeliner. Um, when I say eyeliner, I mean just the lid because you know 
your girl don't do wings. Yeah. So I'm just doing like a thin line, not a very like thick liner because I just want to sort of give my eyelashes a little bit of character rather than just showing them off. I didn't just forget, but I just remembered. <laughs> I just forget. I just remembered that I use eyeshadow as eyeliner, and I usually use a tiny brush to get onto my um, waterline. now take a look at these eyeballs now because they'll probably be good y'all know that I always contour with this contour stick my gran she had this beautiful 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 blusher brush Blush, brush, blush, or brush. Try saying that fast ten times. Blush, or blush, blush, or blush, blush, blah. <laughs> blush, or blush, blush, or blush, blush, or blush, blush, or blush. Guys, I've tried it. Like, blush, or brush, blush, or brush, blush, or brush, blush, or blush. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> As I was saying, she had a blush brush, right? And it was this, it was thick. And when I say thick, I mean it was this thick. Just the, the, the stem was that thick. It was literally that thick. And then the brush came out and it was this thick, like, how? How? Wow. <laughs> Your people back in the day, like... But I swear this is going to be like my children one day, like watching and being like, Mom, you apply your makeup so weird. Not that they're going to be American or anything, but, you know. I'm going to attempt to do the eyeliner now. I've been procrastinating. I've been procrastinating. So, get right up on there. Y'all, I nearly put this brush away and grabbed my highlighter brush. Okay, now we're going to use our blusher. Okay, I'm gonna use... Let's try this, guys. Should I just call the highlighter blush? I mean, that's actually not applying too bad, you know? It's actually not very, like, messy and, you know, like, my boot gets in the way. Let me actually get to the other side of my freaking face. I can't believe it. Now I'm going to try and bronze. Okay, that's not working very well. Wow, that looks terrible. Okay, um, I'm gonna apply my mascara and then I'm going to be done. Okay, so we're done. My makeup looks terrible. <laughs> Um, but thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and show me love, love. I love you, my little daisies.